Hey, yo, what's up, guys? Enviously here. Uh, real quick, I'm gonna give you an update on where I think you should be grinding in BDO. If you just come back, you're a little bit off season, you're decently geared, um, and you're not sure where to go. Some of the Calpheon and Serenia Elvia places can be a little out of range of your gear right now. And then maybe Orcs is too contested for you. I recommend Thornwood. You can see on the screen right now that it's around 650 to 700 mil an hour, depending on how fast you grind. And also you get Venomous Night Fangs. And I'll go into the, more of those in a second. But just having access to these fangs as a new player, as a returning player, as someone who's still working on their Caphras, is huge. Uh, the AP cap here is pretty low, so you can wear the Lightstone set, the Wild, to push another 30 Kama Sylvia damage. These mobs don't really hit that hard. They do stun and stiff a little bit, so you may want to have a little bit higher resistances if that's annoying. As long as you're rotating your front duels and super armors, though, you shouldn't get, you know, stunned or caught too much. Um, I notice I'm getting a ring probably every other hour, maybe sometimes a little slower than that. <clears throat> but they do drop, and as long as you grind here for a couple hours, uh, you will consistently get them. You can also have those knockout hours where you're hitting like three rings an hour, which is just amazing. You know, that's whatever a billion silver you're getting. Um, so back to the fangs. The fangs drop here, I think average is around 10, uh, maybe a little more right now with the drop event we have. But each fang is worth around 20 mil intrinsic value. So if you're to go get a group of friends and you each run you know, a 50 fang group, you're gonna pull about a billion silver out of that. It's gonna take you about 30 minutes, um, maybe faster if you get a shy or a really optimized group. But just having access to all those Cafres so easily and not having to buy them, <clears throat> It's huge. So what I like to do is grind here. No one's really here. I chill, do it on stream. You can grind here safely during the day, safely at night. I think in my gear, they can't even kill me anymore. But um, I think we're on the 660 or 265 AP bracket and maybe like 330, 335. You should be cozy here. And again, grab the wild Kama Sylvia set and just set your tent and get going. Uh, as for the things, you can ask in server chat and some other discords, your guild. You'll see people in world chat saying, hey, you know, we've got 50 fang group looking for one more. Um, then you run these over and over to Lita. Uh, I wish I had footage to show you what it looks like. But essentially three little balls as you fight. And when you're done, everyone puts one scroll in. So you're running five at a time. It's stupid money per hour if you're running the scrolls. So being able to grind here um, and pull out these 10 things an hour just really adds to that silver per hour. So you don't really calculate it as silver per hour because you still have to go run those, but being that you can run 50 fangs as a group in 30 minutes and make so much money is, is super nice. So if you're looking for a place to grind, you're not too sure where to go, uh, you're pretty geared, but you're not you know, kind of in that medium position, check out Thornwood. Uh, I think after a couple hours, you'll, you'll really like it. All right, see you guys soon. Peace.